Good morning, Albrightians, Albright family. We came through this semester roaring like lions. It's really a testimony to the strength of our community, our lion pride, I guess. And it's a connection that we all celebrate. Of course, our hope is to be able to be back on campus this fall, meeting face to face and participating in all of the usual activities uh, that fill Albright's campus, from music to athletics, to club activities and Greek life, to service events and academic events and even experience events. But we must continue to attend to the details of this pandemic and guard against the potential for resurgence. To provide the most flexibility in our plan for the fall, in the face of unknown environmental conditions, we are going to alter our academic schedule. Instead of two 15-week semesters, classes next year will be conducted in four seven-and-a-half-week terms during which students will take two classes each term, so still able to earn four course credits each semester. The shorter terms, but with fewer courses, will allow more opportunity for social distancing in classes and strict attention to sanitizing surfaces between classes. This will also allow us greater flexibility to move on or off campus as dictated by prevalence of the coronavirus and the potential for renewed incidents and spread. We're just trying to keep ahead of everything. This model also affords us the highest potential for student success. A two plus two model of course delivery within each semester lessens the disruption of the semester in the sense that conducting four online courses at one time, if there has to be a change in the middle, is a lot of pressure for faculty. And what we've learned from this spring is that juggling four online courses is a lot for students. So if we are working online, reducing the experience to two courses at a time is better for faculty and students. Um, and, and student learning. Educational research also shows us that greater focus on fewer courses helps to reduce attention fatigue, that drag towards the end of the long semester. So whether we are on campus or online, it's just easier to maintain focus over seven weeks, and we're expecting that this will help to foster more student success. In preparation for this, we will be supporting many opportunities this summer for faculty to continue to develop their abilities to use technology to engage students in coursework, whether on campus or off campus. We'll be releasing more specific details about all of these schedule arrangements and how we will safely return to campus later this summer by July 1st, as we continue to develop our plan and continue to monitor COVID-19 projections. Whether we're here on campus or scattered to our houses, we all sleep under the same stars. That's the connection that we share. And so we hope that you move into the summer uh, with some anticipation of some good things. And we really look forward to the time when we can all be back together again here on Albright's campus.